here's another guy that's had a lot of tough breaks this year. We talked about Ken Schrader earlier, and Brent Rodin falls into that same category. Just had so much tough luck with the Junior Johnson car. He is 22nd in points and has only recorded two top 10 finishes. Top of the frame. Watch from the camera in turn two. He's on the inside, on the outside, I guess, of the 87 car. Was that Neiman yep, check? Looked yep, like it. I think it was. There is Todd. He's climbed out of the car. He's okay. And the other two are going to get rolling again. Hey, watch out, Jeff. You might run over Todd. Let's take a look at it. There's Todd Bedine up on the outside. Back end breaks loose. Hits the wall right down in front of Ted Musgrave. Morgan Shepard goes by. Bobby Hamilton goes by. Then he comes back up in front of the other traffic. Including Jeff Gordon. Hey, here's Greg Sachs on the inside of uh, Jeff Bodine, but they save it. Here comes Roy Allen had a notion to come down there, but he, well, yeah, he does. He comes on down there. Here there are three abreast going into that turn. That doesn't work. So they get together and around they go. The track closes up, nowhere to go. And four, five, six, seven, lots of race cars got involved. Well, John, uh, really pretty, pretty stupid. Uh, we were a lap down, and we're just trying to get out of the way of the lead lap car, let them race for the win here. We've been having some problems, made an adjustment at that last stop, and you know the XI T bird was starting to run good, but still I was letting those guys go so they could race. And the 31 car got under me off of turn four, and I guess Rick Mass tried to go under him into turn one, and that's three wide, and that's uh, impossible here at Darlington. It's hard enough to go in there by yourself, let alone three cars. And I guess he hit it, hit the 31, 31 hit me. And you told me 10 cars got in that wreck. That's, that's terrible. That's ridiculous. Uh, I know Rick didn't do it on purpose, but it was really pretty stupid. We were just trying to finish this darn thing. Uh, you know, and that's what you have to do here when you're having a problem, just kind of let the guys run for the win, for the lead, uh, let them run and you just finish the race. And here we sit, the tore up race car, really discouraging, but that's part of the racing, and you know, that's a big part of what happens here at Darlington. But at this time of the race, you would think maybe early in the race you'd see these kind of wrecks. Uh, normally, as the race goes on, guys uh, slow down a little bit, get a little more patience, but not today. 